everybody, it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan here with another Plan With Me video. I'm going to be planning for January 15th through 22nd in my fitness planner. So as you see here, this is my B6 Traveler's Notebook where I keep my fitness insert, my social media insert, lists, and my happy planner. So I'll just show you quickly, this is my happy planner in the back. And then my fitness insert is up here at the front under meal plan. And I put everything into one notebook just because I like to have everything in one spot. So it's this Traveler's Notebook system and the fact that I discovered that the B6 Traveler's Notebook holds the mini happy planner has just been a game changer for me. So I'll just show you here. This was the week of January 1st through 7th. And then because I'm filming this on Sunday, January 7th, um, the week of January 8th through 14th is not filled out yet but I'm just showing you what an after the pen looks like. And then I'm just gonna take the insert out of my notebook. And then just show you, this is an insert from Annie Plans Printables. And she did a collaboration with the Planner Society for the December kit. So flip to the page that I need, and hold it down with some paper clips. All right, so this week I will be using, what am I using? I am using this Party Penguins um, mini happy planner kit from Green Darner Designs along with these deco sheets. And I wanna show you how even if a kit is made for the mini happy planner, classic happy planner, big happy planner, Erin Condren, whatever it is, that you can use it in any insert, in any planner whatsoever. Don't ever be limited to which stickers you can use in your planner because it says it's made for a certain size. These are just stickers. You can cut them and make them work in any planner you wish. All right, so let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do is actually draw the lines in that separate my breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks using this ruler that I bought from Michaels. So each row is going to be one inch tall and that's perfectly enough space for me to write in. And I'm using my Micron fine liner pen in 0 0.20 millimeters so I get that finest line possible. Perfect. So the next thing I'm gonna do is measure the width of each of the dates columns, and then I'm gonna cut down the date headers, date covers to fit into each of the columns. This kit was made for the mini happy planner, but what I wanna show you guys is that you don't have to limit yourself to just kits made for B6 Traveler's Notebooks or Happy Planners or Erin Condren's. These are stickers that you can cut down or layer to make work for you. So for Saturday and Sunday, I'm gonna place down a couple of full boxes as well as a few of the deco stickers. Like these penguins are so cute. And on Saturday, that full box, it has a bit of room for me to write down my weigh in for the week. So I'm gonna take these two washi headers and because they don't go all the way, it allows me to be a bit more creative with layering. Now that checklist box in the top right hand corner is where I'm going to keep track of my steps that I take Monday through Friday. And then placing the other washi header on the left hand side of the spread with another full box in the corner. And that top portion there is where I'm going to keep track of the workouts that I do each day. Now I don't need a lot of space to write down my workouts. It's more that I just wanna track that I've done it. I need more room to write down the food that I eat each day. And those icons at the bottom are going to represent how many smart points I've eaten each day compared to my daily smart points budget. So now I have a chance to get a little bit more decorative. So placing a few of the deco stickers around the spread. And the thing with the decoration is that it does not impede any functionality whatsoever. It still allows me to be functional without sacrificing any of the cuteness. So I'm going into my um, Mambi sticker books here. I like to go into these books because they have some great translucent quote stickers. So finding a few like this is big. I love this because the color scheme works perfectly with this spread. And then this is the uh, 
Happy Memory Keeping Lion Sticker Book. Good stuff. The gold foiling on some of these stickers is just amazing. But that is it for me, guys. It was a very short plan with me. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and have yourselves a great day.